I love Erin's paintings because you can see her thought processes. It's almost like a visualization of thought. She starts with an object, a, sh a shape, taken from an object in her home, or a color that she's seen and wants to reproduce, and she makes a shape on the canvas, which makes a problem for her, so she has to make another shape to solve that problem, which makes another problem that she has to make another shape to solve that problem. And she's always dealing with a transparency combined with um, the raw linen that she uses as a contrast, parts of them are very painterly, parts of them are very opaque and kind of hard edge.